Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. Today we have a very interesting custom. Uh, this is Silver Dynaco 51 Lightning McQueen uh, as described by the original creator of this. Uh, this is a piece I got for my birthday a few months ago. Uh, just something I threw on the list uh, just because I thought it was cool and, and I ended up getting it. It was, I believe it was somewhere in the 40 to $50 range which is uh, a very good deal because this is a very well done custom even though it's a pretty simple idea. Um, uh, the creator is, uh, I don't remember his, his, e his eBay name is Jojo1974 I believe uh, and his Instagram is Jo1974. Um, he still has a few customs up on eBay that look really cool such as like a stealth mater uh, which uh, is one of my favorites. Uh, this is the only one of his I have uh, currently, but maybe in the future uh, I'll see one I like. Um, so basically the whole deal with this guy, it's not like a silver version uh, of the Fabulous McQueen, it's just a, a whole new paint scheme. I believe it's actually the same as Dynaco Cruises with a few, I guess, small changes. Um, it's, it's made using the original Cars 1 wider body. And it's painted, I wouldn't even say it's like a silver. Uh, it looks very close to my silver, but it's like a matte, it's almost like a matte silver, but not, it looks matte, but it's not, uh, where it's not quite as, like, you know, metallic. Uh, the thing that really seals this whole thing together is the way he did the eyes, uh, that matches very well with the rest of the paint. Uh, the only real, I guess, bad thing would be the windows, uh, the window bars are not painted, but I don't really have a good deal with that. Adds a little bit more character. Got the 51. I can see the sort of the outline of where I put the decals. Uh, nothing too wrong with that. Uh, it doesn't really appear unless you're like looking up way up close. Uh, over here on this side, the decal is on good. Uh, over here, the decal actually is sort of peeling off, and it has been since I got it, but uh, not too too big of an issue. Uh, on the base, you can see through it and all that. Um, it's all perfectly fine. Uh, the 51 up top. Uh, yeah, they're all the same font. Uh, I, I believe this is the same font that Cruz has, um, but don't quote me on that. The Dynaco thing that goes around the, around the wheel is, of course, from Cruz. Pretty much all of this is from Cruz. Got the Dynaco thing on the rear spoiler. Um, on the back, have the Dynaco logo, the taillight logos, as well as the 51. Uh, that's something I actually haven't noticed yet. Uh, the headlights and the rear taillights are also there, uh, so either he had to paint around them, which I doubt, because I've tried to do that and it doesn't work, um, or he had to completely put new decals on, which it looks like he did, so uh, big ups to him for that. Uh, all in all, this comes together really well. My favorite part has to be the wheels, the sort of mid-brighter blue, sort of like a neon dark blue. <laughs> Um, it looks really, really nice, especially fits with all the silver uh, and the metallic uh, purplish-blue decals. Um, the mouth, uh, the teeth are in a smiling position, doesn't quite match the uh, original uh, mouth shape of the mold, but it does give him sort of a new expression, so that's, uh, that's actually pretty cool. Uh, I wonder if uh, this custom wasn't painted silver, or if they would have painted the dots up here, the, I guess, bolts or whatever they're actually called, um, sort of like a gray or maybe even a silver color. Uh, so that's the theory. Uh, everything else looks nice. I say other way too much. I mentioned that way too much. Mm, so yeah, this is a very cool one. I, I really like it. I got it back. And of course, January, uh, really, really stylish. Looks really nice, especially next to all the prototypes because that's pretty much the only, this is the only custom where it doesn't really fit with any of the other ones, things I have. So it goes next to the FCs and the prototypes. Sandwiched right, right in between the uh, prototype Steel Blue Jack and Storm and the Dark Decals of Pricky Yardley. So yeah, that is pretty much it for today's video. A lot of stuff, uh, a big video coming up in the next few days. Still working on a few other projects, and I hope to see you in the next video. Bye.